Yo, what's good, guys? So I gave Pow World a try. And, uh, you know, when I saw my status, uh, a couple of you were interested in it. But the majority of you guys, I think the 60%, weren't interested in me playing Pow World, which is fine. But I gave it a try because see what all the fuss was about. I'm hearing that it's good. You know, I'm hearing Moist Critical talk that it was good. Uh, some ordinary gamers talking about it. And I, I even heard uh, Proto Mario uh hinted that he liked it i never saw any of his videos about it but it's because he does everything on twitch so i don't really get on twitch but um yeah i gave it a try on my xbox one and uh, or the series x or s i mean and it was free on game pass so i was like let me try it on game pass first and if i like it i'll get it for pc just so you know just so i don't have to keep switching consoles every now and then because you know series s doesn't have a lot of gigs so I tried it on the cloud. It was responding quite well. And jumping in, the customization, the creative character, uh, they're very feminine. Not that that's a problem. I don't care. It's just that's very feminine of him. Even Review Tech USA was. I thought he was. I thought he purposely made that character the way he wanted her. But no, that's the default character. So I thought that was funny. The gameplay, I like it. It reminds me a lot of. Uh, it reminds me a lot of uh, Pokemon Arceus and Conan Exiles. And I love Conan Exiles. That's my favorite uh, survival game. Like, and there's a lot of um, there's a lot of Conan Exiles in this game, but I'll get to that in a little bit. Pokemon Arceus, though, that was one of the best Pokemon games ever, in my opinion. Next to Leaf Green and uh, Pearl and all that junk like that. Even the old school ones. Yeah, I know I'm those persons. I don't violate and stuff. I'm not into that, but that's a different time. This game, yeah, you do run around and throw stuff at the Pokeball. Or you throw stuff at the Pal. Capture them in your little crystal. Which, that thing looks a lot cooler than Pokeballs. So, I like that whole crystal thing. The, uh, the combat is okay. If there's no problem with it. I just, I know it's a video game. So... Go ahead and rip on me if you want to. It's just a video game. I know the difference between video game and reality. But I feel bad hitting those pals with a freaking spear. Like, I feel bad. I feel bad hurting those little things. They're cute. You know, why would you want to hurt them, right? And the, I, and the whole guns. I don't like guns in RPG games. I've never liked guns in RPGs. I don't know what it is. It's just I don't like it. It's like strawberry ice cream. I don't like strawberry ice cream. But, I mean, I'll eat it if it's there. Same with the guns in this game. I'll use them if they're there. And I only caught two pals. A sheep and a little fox. I don't remember the fox's name. I think it's basically Vulpix and Charmander having a baby. So I built my base. I, I went deeper into... That's what I like. The map is pretty cool. I went really deep into the map to look for a specific area I wanted to be in, which was... I was looking for a waterfall, an uh, area next to a waterfall, next to a pond, because in my in my head, I'm role-playing like, I want to find a spot where it's relaxing and my pals can have access to water, even though that's not how the game works, it's just role-playing, right? Found me a cool little spot and, you know, gathering wood. The, the trees in this game, they come back pretty fast, so... You have access to wood, and like the uh, Ark Survival, you way too much you can't move, so I thought that was a, an annoying feature, but it's there, because I was afraid that my stuff would despawn if I threw it on the floor. The building is pretty simple. It's a little annoying, but it's simple. What I mean by annoying is that just the, the placing is kind of dumb. But maybe it's just me, because, you know, I'm looking for the most weirdest spots to build, because uh, in Conan... Exiles, there's a thing called the Purge, and I don't know if this game has it. Maybe it does, maybe it doesn't. I didn't play too much to find out. Only two, three hours in. Uh, the Purge, what it does is you can't... There, if The more killings you do in, and the more things you do in Conan Exiles, there's a Purge meter. If that fills up, then an army of whatever you were fighting or whatever area that you live in, there's an army trying to come at you and take all your stuff and destroy your base. So, yeah. So, and, and like Conan Exiles, the reason why I like it more is because you could actually bunk people on the head and take them as your slaves, which is what this game does too. 
you enslave these pals to do your dirty work. Conan Exiles kind of does the same thing, but it doesn't do it in the way this game does. In that game, you bonk somebody on the head and they're a cook. You put them next to your fireplace and they cook food for you faster. I don't know if this game does that as well, but I do know that you can have... Like, one of my sheeps were gathering items for me. They were getting wood. Or no, they were getting rocks, actually. I need, and I need a rock, so, yeah. So I do like that in this game. You get that little uh, feature where they help you. You get to pet them. I thought that was nice. You get to pet them. But other than that, uh, I tried fighting. And I was okay with the fighting, you know. I, I Obviously, uh, the way I wanted to do this was I wanted my cute pals, my cute little sheep, my cute little fox. I was looking to keep them at the base so they could protect it. I don't like I said I don't know if there was a purge system or anything but I wanted them to protect it and I would just get stronger myself and take on everything by myself even though the whole point of the game is collect pals so they can help you but man uh I just got bored of it after three hours of playing I just got bored of it there's no it doesn't feel rewarding like the way Conan does and Conan you know there's no gun there is magic, but there's a complicated system of how to use magic. And, and it's not that. It's not that the fact that there's guns in this game. It, it, it's not that. I could play a game that has guns in it that's an RPG, and I'll be okay with it. it was, yeah, I just didn't like it. I It feels... This game feels... Foolish, if that makes any sense. It feels... You know what I mean? Like It, it just feels like this game is like... Like Saints Row. I hated Saints Row. Saints Row was trash. But everybody loves it because of how goofy it is. That's what I think this game is. It's, it's meant to be goofy. Because, oh, a Pokemon with a gun. How hilarious, you know? Like, I don't know. That, that shit don't... It don't vi I don't vibe with that kind of stuff. Maybe it's... Maybe that's my problem. I take things a little too literal or too serious. But I have nothing bad to say about the game, though. I mean, it, it, it moved flawlessly. You know, it played flawlessly. I didn't have any bad connections. The combat was responsive. The building is fairly simple even though i was playing it on hard yeah i didn't feel i like how it when it's dark as fuck it gets dark you can't see anything i like that there's different cows in the area when it's dark that's a pretty cool touch just like good old in, in the the environment the environment is actually quite interesting it reminds me of a. Uh, you guys ever play that one game oh my god i forgot what it's called holy shit i forgot what it's called it's like monster hunter it was created by Epic Games. See people behind Fortnite. Oh my god, I forgot what it was. But yeah, it was like that. Like the environment kind of reminded me of that. In fact, it's probably the same engine. I don't know. <laughs> but other than that, yeah, I don't really. I'm not into the. I'm not interested in it. It's it's boring. It's boring. You know, I'd rather play Conan Exiles, but even that game gets boring to me. But I want to get the DLCs for it. So. Uh, yeah, I wanted to give it a try, see what all the fuss was about, and it lives up to its hype. I'll give it that. It's not a bad game. I don't like that it's early access, though, because, you know, I already said what I said about early access games in my review of Grimlord, but I'll say it again right here. Early access game is just, it's just lame because, you know, you're going to be all overpowered and everything, and then when the chapter two comes out, it's gonna you're going to go through it like nothing. I prefer the game to be released when it's ready to be released not this whole season two kind of mumble jumble just kind of kills it for me to be honest i'd rather have a demo and that's it yeah. but if you like the game i'm pretty sure other people like it go for it i don't i have nothing bad to say about it and that's coming from a guy who hates most games I'd, i'll put it to you this way i would rather play minecraft than play this which is kind of like Oh, that's no big deal. Everybody would rather play Minecraft. Yeah, but the but the thing is about Minecraft. Minecraft is just that's all it is. Just building, building and, and exploring certain areas. But there's nothing rewarding about Minecraft compared to this game. That's the thing. At least in this game, like oh, I caught something great and strong. But in Minecraft, oh, I just found diamonds. No, oh, I found netherite. You can't have any pet. Well, you can't have pets. Sorry. But you can't have, like, partners, you know? Like, that's why I like Conan Exiles better. You build stuff better, and you can bunk women on the head and take them as your slaves, and they could be your 
tough warriors. You could imprison somebody. You know, there's so much you could do. Not that I do that, except for the bunk on the head part. But this game, yeah. Eh, I, didn't, I didn't feel right killing a chicken and eating it. I became a whole vegan. The berries in this game are so OP, so... Yeah. Like, gather the berries. Keep fucking, uh... Keep respawning to that one spot where you start. And just gather all those berries that keep there. Everything re comes back, like, in a matter of seconds, so... But I'm pretty sure they're gonna patch that, and it's gonna be boring. But yeah, so, uh, if you like, you can enjoy the rest of this gameplay. I, I, I'm not gonna continue it anytime soon, it's just... I just wanted to give it a try, but, yeah. 6 out of 10, that's what I'll give it. If that's unfair to you, because I only played 2 or 3 hours of it, that's fine. I don't really plan on returning to it. But, I mean, eh. Never know, right? You never know. I'll pr I didn't like Conan Exiles at first, but when I came back to it, I loved it, so. Maybe it's the same with this game. Maybe I gotta be bored as fuck. That's the thing. I have to be really, really bored in order to play this stuff. But other than that, if you would like to see more of me playing this, I won't stream it because I don't think it'd be fun to stream compared to Minecraft, which is not fun either, but at least at least something funny will happen in Minecraft compared to this game. And if you, yeah, if you'd like to see me play more of it like this, I'll, I'll do it. I gotta see uh, some comments and likes on it, though. If I don't, it's all good. But take care, guys. I hope you at least enjoy the game. And that's all that matters. If you enjoy it, that is all that matters, right? Look at my cute little sheep. Take care, guys. Much love. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. 
Huh?
What?